everybody and welcome back to our YouTube channel. We are as always your hosts Arne and Carlos and today we are going to show you what happened in the dollhouse. Ah, got a little update for you guys <laughs> from the dollhouse. So before uh, we open the doors and bring you inside the Arne and Carlos miniature universe. I think it's more Arne's miniature universe. So I'm going to give you the honest to talk about it. Mm. But before you start talking about the updates, <laughs> Uh, I have some very important things that we need to get out of the way, uh, the formalities as we call them. If you like the video, give us a big thumbs up. Uh, please subscribe to our channel if you're not already doing it. The Arne and Carlos family grows all the time and we'd really love to have you as a subscriber. And finally, if you turn on your notifications, you will never miss an episode. So go ahead and do that. You won't regret it. Okay, Arne. Okay, let's open the doors. Shall we open the doors? So, da -da -da -da. now we have light in every room Ooh. and the Christmas tree is still out in there because we found these in a shop here in Norway. People use them for Christmas. You can put them on Christmas gifts oh, and yeah. stuff and they're on battery. Oh yeah, the house is still in Christmas mode. So it's still in Christmas mode. But it's really nice when the sun has gone down in the middle of, in the night, we can put on the lights and it it's, a very, it's nice to walk by the room and look at the light in the windows. So I have a question for you. You know, like in Germany, mm -hmm. I know that in Germany there's a store where it's Christmas the whole year round. Now, is it so that this room here is Christmas all year round or is it just that the... I think it will be... The tenants were too lazy to throw away the Christmas tree. I think it can be Christmas the whole year. Yeah. Because we got more of the stitch markers and since we hardly never use stitch markers, we keep them on the knitted Christmas tree that mm. we made. I think that's also on our blog. So a lot of nice stitch markers. I see that Blythe, the Blythes are out. And they're out now. Yeah, they went on holiday. They went on holiday. And they asked their friends uh, to babysit, not to babysit, sorry, to uh, house sit for them. And so uh, Magnus, there's two of them here. They're back. Uh, they're back. And you know, this year is the year of the rat. <laughs> so I think it was very fitting that Blythe uh, asked Magnus to come and, and do the babysitting. No, why am I talking about babysitting? They're house sitting. <laughs> they're not babysitting, the Blythe is gone. They're on holiday in Japan. Yeah, so the, the, and, and Magnus and Magnus, they're house sitting. The house they sitting. are taking care of the house. But there are new two people in the house, and that is these two. That is, oh yeah, <laughs> this is Carlos, oh. and this is me. This yep. is a gift from a nice lady in Canada. In St. Thomas. She made this for us as a gift. Yeah. So this is the Arne and Carlos knitted dolls for the dollhouse. So now we've moved in here as well. Yeah. With, actually, we haven't moved in. We're just house sitting, we're house -sitting. together with Magnus <laughs> and Magnus. So we're taking care of the house, watering the plants. Um, and uh, many of you may not know this, but uh, the only indoor plants we succeed with are the ones that don't need much watering. So we do have a lot of cactus here that have survived many, many years. Just, actually, as, just as the Blythe have. We actually have cactus in the house here also. So what about the things we haven't talked about? Well, we have a new quilt on the wall. Oh yeah. That's a gift from our America trip. Oh, and yeah. the quilt is made out of the fabrics from the fabric collection we made for Mets. Let me take out Magnus. Maybe Magnus can sit here on the chair and just uh, yeah. <laughs> relax. He's going to have a nap there so you can yeah. see the quilt. So that's that's new. And, and I like it how do you how uh, how you use those tags. The safety. To, the, yeah, I don't know what they're called in English, but those tic tacs yeah. and just attached to the wall like that. I think that's a very nice solution. For a piece of fabric. Yeah. It's easy. And then what more do we have? Yeah, we have a horse. This we got also on a trip in America from a nice lady called Sina. Oh yeah, Hansina. Sina. Yeah, she was, uh, we met her in Maine in uh, Freeport. So thank you, Hansina. It's lovely. I it's think we're going to see Hansina soon. Yeah, I hope so. On the Coastal Express. Ah. She's coming in the March tour. So see you soon. <laughs> so the, ro the horse is now in the dollhouse where it belongs. Thank you. That's nice. I mean, the blank, the floor carpet, we also got as a gift in, in America, in uh, Rockville, I think. Rockville. Rockville, and the same 
in this room. Mm -hmm. Persian carpets, yeah. wow. And then when we, when we travel, I always uh, bring stuff from home because I think it's kind of like, I like to clean up the studio while we travel. So this time on the trip, we took yarn from color cards and that is color cards we get when we go to the trade shows in Florence. Mm -hmm. So this is actually crocheted with uh, two ends of yarn from a color card. And it's uh, hook number zero zero. I zero think. zero something. Yeah, and this is from a Knit and Crochet Garden, the Primrose Row. This is the Primrose And blanket. it's the same Primrose Row that we have on uh, on our uh, on, on our YouTube channel, Gunild, I think it's called. Yeah, and you know when you get all these nice color cards with yarn when you go to the, the Pitti Filati show in Florence, it's really hard to throw it away because the colors are mm. nice. So yeah. instead we do floral blankets. So, if you want to do this, you can actually use like normal embroidery yarn yeah. and just take one of the threads and wind up like one thread and then you can make it. And you can take, uh, you can get the pattern on our website at arnecarlos.com. It's for a big floral crochet throw, but as you see, the thinner the yarn, the thinner the knee, the hooks, the smaller the the rug will or the blanket or afghan will come out. So just go to our website to get the pattern, and you can start crocheting and having a lot of fun. So we're going to collect a lot of blankets in the bed in the dollhouse, and I think that's the new thing we have now. Mm -hmm. It's so, a great thing. And it's getting more and more full and we still have space for the, on the walls. We could have some shelves with stuff and pictures. Mm. Maybe we should so, do some crochet curtains. Could be, be crochet fun. curtains. There are, there are more coming. Yeah. And we're going to make another dollhouse as well for the big knitted dolls. But that's in the future. So that, that's the new thing from the dollhouse. And if you have, and if you, maybe you have a dollhouse, please let us know. And Maybe you can post some pictures and hashtag us. No, yeah, that would be cool. It could be cool if you can see your dollhouse. And I'm, I was wondering, I mean, if you had the possibility, would you crochet uh, Gunild, the, the floral blanket for the dollhouse? Or would you crochet it for yourself? We'd really love to know uh, what, you, what you would do. Would you be uh, willing to do it with those tiny little hooks? Or do you prefer the thicker hooks for a bigger blanket? Tell us in the comments field and uh, we will be reading those and hopefully uh, enjoy ourselves while we do that yeah so thank you so much for watching <laughs> it's been a pleasure uh, going into the dollhouse um, but now we have to leave uh, magnus and uh, magnus, <laughs> magnus in peace and quiet because it's uh, they usually take a nap this time of the day so we're going to go into another room so we don't disturb them and i think we just have to Lock close the, door. the doors a little bit carefully so. they might have already fallen asleep so we will be back with more if more happens. Yes. And I guess more will happen in the dollhouse. So see you again. See next you. Week. <laughs> Bye. Bye. Shh. 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 Your child is. Hello.